This is Earl Vernacular TV. Beam blunting, sparking conversation. Sparking conversation. Singer Jill Scott. She is facing a backlash because she give credit to singer Chris Brown. In his ongoing beef with the mango rapper Quavo, Chris Brown dropped a diss song, Weakest Link. For the record, I would say, in this current times, I'm not into black people, black male, beefing with each other. However, Chris Brown is a very talented artist, Weakest Link, has went viral. The singer, Jill Scott, a beautiful black woman. I love Jill Scott. She's the personification of what a black woman should be as a singer. She's not saying her booty hole is brown. She's not degrading black women. She's the personification. Jill Scott, Lauren Hill, Inia Ari, these sisters represent black women in the positive regards. However, Jill Scott, she give credit to Chris Brown. She said, this brother can rap. He's very talented. And there is a backlash now. They want to cancel Jill Scott. Many fans came to, to attack Jill Scott. Bringing about Chris Brown, domestic violent issue that he had with Rihanna. And the other allegation by his ex-girlfriend, Karuchi. However, Jill Scott, she said... I am talking about his talent. Chris Bryant is talented. He's a very talented brother. The brother can sing. He can play basketball. He can rap. He can dance his ass off. Every time they're trying to get Chris Brown some type of credit, the woke feminists, the mob, they come and attack. So people are bringing up Chris Brown domestic violent stuff of the past with Rihanna. Rihanna and Chris Brown at that time, they were young people. Both were abusive towards each other. It is wrong to abuse any woman. It is wrong. However, it has been a long time since 2009. They are still holding this stuff on this young man's head. Every time you give Chris Brown some kind of credit for his talent and his art, these bots on the internet, these women, these bots, robot on the internet, they're commenting on the page. They are trying to cancel Jill Scott because she said this brother can rap. He's a bad man. His weakest link disc record towards Quavo, she said he's very talented. Same thing. Kelly Rowland gave Chris Brown his flower and it came for her. Anytime anybody give Chris Brown his flower, it comes for him. You have to learn to separate the man from his art. What Chris Brown did, I don't condone it at all. However, he's a very talented young man. Rapping, singing, playing basketball. He's an artist. He draws pictures. He do all kind of artistic things. Very versatile. Chris Brown is a special artist. Every time this young man is giving credit, they want to beat him down. They want to knock him down. Even Kathy Hart. He faced, he faced the media backlash for things he said years ago. That he couldn't host the Oscar. They give him all that smoke for for the things he's made years ago. The comment he's made about his own child years ago. The cancer culture. They are always trying to cancel people. Forget Chris Brown the man. Let's talk about his art. He can dance. He can rap. He can sing. He can play basketball. This guy is very versatile. Give the man his credit. However, Jill Scott said her stepfather. He was an abusive man. However, he was a bricklayer. He was the best bricklayer in the city. Regardless if he were abusive or not, he ability to lay bricks warring the credit that he got. She said, you got to do the shadow work. Let it go. Heal. She have done the shadow work by letting things go and heal them because her stepfather was an abusive man. But they move out of that condition. She forgive and she heal. She's telling those women that are attacking her about Chris Brown, giving Chris Brown some type of credit because he can rap. Separate this young man from his art. 
If Chris Brown ever get convicted in the court of law and have to do jail time because he beat a woman or he disrespected or, or, or S.A. a woman, that's what it is. However, the art has to be separated. Same thing with R. Kelly. That brother is a very talented man. Whatever allegation, whatever conviction that is on his head and the time that he's serving in prison, so be that. But the art, the foundation of music R. Kelly laid for 30 years since the 1990s, Many of these young children were born on the songs of Ira Kelly. Give these young, give these people, give Chris Brown, give Ira Kelly their credit in the music endeavor, not in their personal lives. Because in our personal lives, we all got stuff too. But as fans, you can criticize from the distance. You can criticize from the internet. Your personal life is not clean. Give Chris Brown his credit. He's a talented dude. Kelly Rowland says something about him. Another, another artist says something about Chris Brown. He can play basketball. Or he can sing. He can rap. He can dance. And you come, you attack him. What about the domestic violence issue he had with Rihanna? He's like, abusive, he this and that. Okay, that's that. It's understandable. Women want to be against Chris Brown because of his past. However, give the man credit for the art that he have, that he have left behind. You understand? Chris Brown, he arose with B2K. Omari on them. Little Bawa them. Where's Little Bawa? Where's Omari? On? But in 2024, Chris Brown is still moving strong and still making timeless music. You got to give the brother his credit. You know? They're always trying to cancel everybody. You want to cancel Jill Scott because she give this young brother some credit? Jill Scott love women. She's the personification of representing womanhood. You understand? Her music, the way she carries herself, is respectable. Jill Scott, I believe, will come to any woman point of defense if she's being attacked. I believe so. However, because she get this man credit, now you want to break her down. You want to try to cancel her. The cancel culture is not going to live. People have different views that you have to respect depending on what spectrum you are. Politically, socially, depending on your spectrum of the politics, conservative or Republican, left or right, in the middle, whatever. These are different views and people have different views and you're going to have to learn to respect it, not try to cancel everybody. Do not cancel Jill Scott because she represents womanhood and I believe she's a feminist. She loves women. She loves, she will support any woman. But give me a little black boy, a little credit, a little black man, a little credit, you want to beat her down. You want to beat Chris Brown down. This is Earl Vernacular.